been in the peach business for four generations. My grandfather started in 1897. He planted this place, the peach tree, and uh, we've, we've been packing peaches ever since, and we always look forward to the beginning of peach season because that's the first fruits of the spring, and uh, everybody enjoys peaches and things that we've enjoyed running Dickie Bob for all these years, and it's, it's Fine. How many peach trees did he originally start out with? Well, uh, we plant a few trees every year. And, uh, the life of a peach tree is about 15 years. And uh, we take out an orchard every 15 years and we plant a new one every year. And we try to plant all varieties. We plant about uh, 25, 20 varieties of peaches and we try to have them overlap. We start the uh, middle of May and we run to in August and uh, we try to have a variety get get right every four or five days and uh, where we can have peaches continuously every, every day for that length of time. And I notice you have a variety of peach products here too. Is that something you all do in-house? Well, we don't do it in-house. We uh, ship the peaches to process them in North Georgia. So he uses our peaches for uh, for jams and jellies, we do do in-house for ice cream. Uh, we're, we're peeling peaches daily, and uh, uh, so our ice cream is very fresh. And when did when did this all start here, the farm stand? Uh, well, we we've been here. Uh, this packing house actually was very historic. It was built in the 1930s by my great grandfather, and uh, so we've been actually packing peaches here in this building. Uh, since then. And, uh, so we have a, a, a wholesale operation where we uh, cool the peaches, size them, package them, and, and then our retail operation here as well. And they go all over the country. I mean, we, we, we go, of course, New York is the biggest market, but we, we go, used to go to all the markets, but most of the peaches now go to the chain stores, uh, Safeway, uh, Walmart, Publix. So we have a sales agent. We don't have the sales out there. We have a sales agent that knows the buyers to the supermarkets and uh, they get in touch with them and find out how many they need and we quote them a price on them and uh, they usually uh, take them and uh, we've had good cooperation with the chain stores in, in handling the peaches. And this all started in 1897. What generation are you? Well, I'm, I'm the third generation. My grandfather started. Uh, uh, his, his, he's the, uh, he was R.L. Dickey the first. I'm R.L. Dickey the second. He's R.L. Dickey the third. And we've got a, he's got a son, R.L. Dickey the fourth. And, and is he going to take over? Uh, well, no. we'll see. <laughs> we have some, uh, definitely a family farm. My wife's involved. Dad, all of us, so it's uh, a lot of tradition here right in these A few years ago, these uh, old ladies came down and they were eating ice cream and getting some peaches. And uh, they came the next week and put the same thing. And I asked them, I said, it, uh, she said, Well, our bridge club meets in Griffin every Tuesday. And says, uh, uh, we decided that uh, after Bridge we just ride down here and get a dessert, an ice cream. It's the best ice cream we've ever eaten, and so we just we ride. We decided to ride down yeah. every Tuesday and, and get a dessert and uh, some pizza to take home to our friends and neighbors.